guys and welcome back to Clearview Driving. Today I'm doing another driving lesson with Millie. Now this is Millie's fourth driving lesson today. So we've been driving for about four weeks nearly. And in the last lesson we worked on pedestrian crossings, right? Mm -hmm. We were looking at the different types. So what were the two different types we mainly discussed? Um, zebra crossings and then traffic lights. Yeah. yeah, so uncontrolled crossings where pedestrians just walk in and controlled crossings like traffic lights. Now you did really well with them by the end. But we didn't do a lot of turning last lesson, it was more main roads and hazards and stuff. Today's lesson we'll be focusing on our left and right turns, being able to go up to 20, sometimes maybe even 30 miles per hour if we can go out a little bit further today. And then focus on how to slow down, how to gear down, just going through that mirror signal manoeuvre routine. So we're going to introduce that a little bit more in today. Mm -hmm. Okay? Any questions before we get started? Don't think so. Okay. That's fine. Okay, um, all right, now we're in a bit of a tricky spot because this lady's parked right in front and boxed you in. So what we'll have to do is um, reverse in a straight line okay. and then come out nice and slow with that clutch control that you do at T-junctions. Okay. So you ready? Yeah. Yeah, okay, so clutch down, hold the brake and then yeah. start. Brilliant, you can turn off the handbrake straight away. That's okay. it, now first gear. All right, let's start the checks again from this side, all the way. Are you ready? No. Good. Shall we indicate? Yes. Okay, now we're going to have to use that slow clutch control. Okay. And steering this time as well. So right foot across. Okay. Clutch at the ready and checking that right mirror and the blind spot again. Now start lifting that clutch. And once you start moving, you may have to dip it back down. Just let that car okay. through. Yeah. But after them, just check to the right again. So just check right again over your shoulder. I will help you if need be, okay? Okay. <laughs> I want you to do as much as you can on your own. So move a little bit more. Now turn the wheel fully to the right. Fully. Now squeeze that clutch down. Turn the wheel fully. Okay. There, you haven't turned it fully. Oh. Turn the whole thing. Turn it all the way. Now clutch down a little bit. Good. Up again to move. Hold it. Don't turn back oh. yet. Not yet. Clutch down. Now turn oh, left sorry. all the way. Turn left. There you go. Okay. Then turn it the other way. You've got this. Okay. And then speed up. Was that better? Yeah. <laughs> I'm not going to let you hit that car. I, I know. know it's not easy, but it's something you've got to get used to. Okay, so we're going to make a right turn out of here first. So okay. mirrors and signal. We did a lot of uphill moving off last time and you did really well with that. Keep straight. Right clutch. Oh, right clutch. Oh, Just that last car. Yeah. We're coming back in a bit early, aren't we? Yeah. Okay. You okay? Yeah. <laughs> okay, I want you to lean forward. Looking on the right there. And now left. When it's clear, yeah. just slowly let go of the brake and let the car roll forward. Okay. Look both, keep looking both ways like this. Keep looking both. Look the other way now. Yeah, if it's clear, use the accelerator and come on, move your right foot over. Okay, Let's stop that. Yeah. After him, is there anyone else? There's just one car. One on the right. Okay, now look there. left again. Left's yeah. clear. Okay. And on the right, I think there's, there's one another. more. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Okay, if we keep waiting for somebody like yeah. down there, okay. we'll be here all day. Okay, okay, so after this guy, accelerate, fighting point, hold it, hold it, and then turn. Remember, you can put your heel down to stabilize your okay. foot a little bit, okay? Brilliant, and then, nice. Okay. Off you go. How do we get rid of that message on the screen? Oh, okay. Yeah, and again. Oh. Now let's pick up the pace a little bit. Okay. It's a nice clear road for the moment. No parked cars. And we've got a bit of a bend going the other way now. Okay, okay now when we reach that roundabout, mm -hmm. we're going to go right. Okay. Just check the right mirror here and just move over a little bit. Now this bit's a bit tight with the car, so you may have to brake. Okay. What do you think? I think it's okay. It's okay for now because it's quite a small yeah. car. Now there's your roundabout, mirror top and right, signal. Don't move left, don't okay. move left. Oh. Okay. okay, we'll talk about it in a minute. Brake a little bit and keep oh, going. God. We're going to keep going, look across to the right, it's clear. Turn it all the way. Good, turn it back. I want you to pull in and park before that silver car, just there. Just top, top and left mirror, keep going, keep going into the next okay. place. Oh, signal. Brake and clutch, move right, and just stop where you are. Stop. Okay. <laughs> Secure the car. Um, Handbrake. 
neutral. I need you to take yeah. a breather. Okay. All right, switch off the engine for a second. Are you okay? No. What's wrong? I don't know, I'm just stressed. You're, you're stressing out over little, little things at I the mean, moment. I went driving with my dad and it went really bad, so I'm just like That's stressed now. probably what it is at the... Well, yeah. You've only been driving for a little bit with me at the moment. It probably gave yeah. you a scare doing that. Yeah. Okay. Did anything happen or...? Yeah, like I bumped a car behind me, but not bad. It's just like, it was like really close to me. Yeah. This car what, that came... What, you were old? He made me like... We had to end up turning down, you know, Forrester's Road. Oh, yeah. So we had to, like, go down there. And then a car came in front of me. Mm -hmm. And then one came really tight behind me. And the one in front of me wouldn't move. And then so we didn't realise how close the car was behind me. So yeah. I, I reversed, like, a tiny bit. But, like, me and, me and my dad didn't, like, judge the distance properly. It wasn't a crash. It was, like, a bump. A little bump, yeah. And that kind of scared you yeah. a little bit. And the guy okay. got really angry about it. Uh, yeah, well, it's not anyway, a nice experience, just, yeah. obviously. I'll be fine in a minute, I'm just yeah. Okay, let's just talk a little bit about um, safety firstly. Now, okay. on my side, you know I've got a brake and a clutch. Okay. Okay? If at any point anything's going on, you're getting too close or you're going too fast, firstly, I'll tell you to slow down. Okay. But if it gets too late and, you know, I need to just take control, I will. Okay. Okay? So nothing's going to happen. Okay. And then in terms of clearance, as you're driving, I'm always telling you to leave enough space yeah. on the sides and I'm watching everything you're doing and I'm looking at every single junction. I'm not relying okay. on you yeah. to make sure it's safe. I'm checking as well as asking you, you know, whether or yeah. not you think it's safe. So building on your judgment over time. Okay. So don't stress, nothing's <laughs> gonna happen. Now the last little bits, we've had two issues on clearance so far, like minor, but you need to be sort of watching out for this. Yeah. So okay. when there's a parked car on your side, and somebody turns up in front or you you know you need to get back to the left what's happening right now is you're kind of ignoring the car okay and you're coming back to the left so it's a bit early you need to kind of go okay well i need to move left but after so and so so pass the car and then come back in so go in when they've gone past so what? the parked car on your left yeah what you're doing is you're kind of straight lining and going back to the left Okay. So what you need to do is you need to go past the car with your one meter clearance and then come back in. Okay. But only when it's there's enough space. Okay. Okay? You ready to go again? Mm -hmm. And another thing, whenever I'm asking you to park, don't feel like you need to do it there and then. Okay. Okay? Yeah. Alright, okay. you ready to go? Yeah. Alright, brilliant. So start the engine and show me how you'd move off from here. So who are we waiting for exactly? Um the just two people behind. Just the two behind, yeah. yeah? So after this blue one, what are you gonna do? Move my foot over. Turn your yeah, turn around and have a look as well. There we go. And let's go. So use your right foot gently because we've got enough space to accelerate and move off as well. Good. Now just drive normally. We've got mm -hmm. plenty of space here at the moment. We've got a few crossings as we're going today. Mm -hmm. Alright, listening to it. Now we're gonna go left at the very end. I want you to watch that white car on the left, the Corsa. Okay. Because that's the last car and that's the car that you keep getting close to. Okay. So to turn left, use your mirrors. Good. Well done. So the crossing's all right? Yeah. Okay, as we're going forward, now a little break and have a look on your right at that junction. How is it? It's okay. Look left and then keep going. How was that? That was okay. That was nice. All right, let's pick out the hazards. What are the hazards along this road? Um, cars and people crossing. Mm -hmm. What about this bin lorry? Is that a hazard? Yeah. Yes, shall we stop? Yeah, maybe. Um, move right a bit. Brake and clutch yeah. here. Brake and clutch, quickly. There we are. I wasn't sure what that okay, learner sorry, was going to do. No, no, yeah. it's okay. You ready to go? Yeah. Just... Are you sure you're ready to go? Uh, no. Yes, brilliant. So yeah, if that learner was any slower, we could have gone, but I think it would have been too tight this. <laughs> so we waited. And we can go after those two, okay? Okay. So move your right foot across and check that top and right mirror. And Just let's go. Right so accelerate. Brilliant. Really quickly along here. Okay. So two cars definitely can't fit here. Now, yeah. don't worry. Just off you go. Brilliant. Good. A bit quicker now though, okay? Because we've got nobody in front of us. Okay. Did you not notice the bin lorry as the hazard? Uh, yeah, that's kind of what I meant by cars. I don't oh, okay, really know. okay. I see. Yeah, I don't. Yeah. Larger vehicles are a bigger concern on these roads because yeah. we were talking about this last lesson, weren't we? Yeah. Because uh. Well, they're not. They need more yeah. space. You're more likely to stop with them, like here, that van, and then that vehicle on the left-hand side oh. again. We can go, but we'll have to stop maybe. So brake a little bit. I think.
think we should be all right. Check right mirror, move over a little bit. A little bit more. Ooh, hold cool. it there, hold it there. Oh. It's okay, carry on. Okay. It was a bit tight, okay. but consider slowing down, that was fine. Yeah. All right, speed up along here now. It's so tricky driving down these roads. Yeah, I don't like driving down the roads <laughs> that much. Okay. See the crossing, is it okay? Yeah. Mm -hmm. okay so far what we're doing yeah um, we're gonna do more turns today which is kind of um, what you were doing like last time yeah I think you're gonna do some stuff with your dad now so yeah meeting situations are really tricky so that's where you've had trouble with the car that you were talking about yeah he shouldn't have taken you on those roads no what can we do here good and what's that one last step yes but without looking down would be great okay good but also listen to the accelerator we need to have it in the background don't we what do you when, mean? when trying to move on oh, press it pressing it down at the same time mm. okay otherwise you're going to get into a habit of just using the clutch and then if you move to a different car you're going to struggle yeah has that been an issue in the other car at all yeah i don't like the it just everything's really hard to push down in that car mm. like what it car feels, is it it's a mini clubman i think okay Yeah, they're quite long, so mm. I kind of find it hard to like judge the. Should I go into second? I don't know. Yeah, go for it. If you're at the right speed, definitely. They are moving. Yeah. But it's just everyone's bunched together at the moment. Oh, Brake clutch, quickly. That's, fine. <laughs> That's all right. No looking down there. He should have really come out really, a bit I thought he was um, putting his hand out for him to cross. I thought he was like, stop, stop. I was like, oh, is that for one person? No, these guys, they kind no. of help with the lorries and stuff. Yeah, like yeah. Here. That's why I was confused. Wasn't I'm it? hoping that lorry's not turning towards us. I'm not really too sure what he's trying to do at the moment. Oh. <laughs> he's just trying to turn. That way. He's probably just trying to help him with the like position in, in that road, even. Yeah. But he's, he's trying to help the lorry turn, yeah. Yeah. With the judgment now. Is it? Right foot across. Okay. Oh, sorry. It's not really coming in, he's just. Oof. Just paying a surprise visit there. Yeah. <laughs> Obviously, yeah. they're going to turn. Okay. So drive normal, but if they look like they're going to turn as you're approaching, yeah. then obviously just deal with it nicely. All right, we're going to just go straight. We've got a few more crossings I want okay. you to identify and deal with. This one's okay. Mm -hmm. It's annoying that the crossing's just after a bend. Yeah. Sometimes you, you have wouldn't... to just be very quick with realizing. Yeah, but the way we can kind of tell there's going to there's bound to be a crossing there is because that's a station. Yeah. yeah. So you know, yeah, people will be crossing. All right, good. Keep oh, it very close to these cars. You did really well there. This yeah. is where I had to help you out yeah. last lesson. We talked about I just the... have to put it in my mind that it's like I'm a lot closer. Well, I'm not as close to them as I think in my head. I don't know. Yeah, as in your right side, you're gonna have to keep it yeah, close, but keep keep, keep watching that distance because on this yeah. side will be okay. Now speed up a little bit. We're gonna park up just after this bus stop. Okay. So. Good. Just go into the shade right there. So with your feet, how do you stop? Do a little bit of break. And then? And just keep rolling slowly, just a little left. That would be great right there. Stop that. Stop. stop. Thank you. We've only parked up for a little while. Yeah, that's okay. fine. Now secure. Um, Good. I always forget that. That's okay. You'll get the hang of that one. Um, and then slow. Yep. Anything else? Okay. And then Switch uh, off the engine. Off, yeah. yeah, that's it. All done. Okay, how was the drive so far? Um, that bit after we'd stopped just after, I felt a bit better to be honest. Okay, now something I want you to 
learn from this bit. Yeah. Whenever you get a bit overwhelmed as you're driving, try and pull over and reflect okay. on what's going on and just start fresh. Okay. Because if we kept driving, honestly, it was going to pile up. Yeah, definitely. This whole snowball effect kicks in and yeah. before you know it, you're panicking. Yeah. Yeah, so it always really just helps stopping over, reflecting on what's going on, having a planning, okay, starting again, yeah. new day, let's drive. Yeah, okay. And that second half was a lot better. Yeah. It yeah. Felt okay. Good. Okay, so what we're going to be doing now is um, we've got a series of roundabouts around here. Now they're quite big roundabouts, but they are very open where you can see across to the right quite easily. Um, there are a few crossings before and after. Okay. So we're kind of working on what we, would, what we did last lesson, but adding a few roundabouts where we're talking about that MSPSL. Now we've been through mirror signal maneuver, right? Mm -hmm. Now that maneuver part is split into position, speed, look, and that's what we're okay. going to go through now. Now, firstly, around here, we're mostly going to be in uh, second gear up to 20 miles per hour. But a bit later on, we're going to try third gear okay. and then be shifting back down as well. Have we tried third gear before? Uh, no, I don't think we have. Okay, so let's just talk about what we're going to do with our approach from second gear. So we're going to be driving up to 20 miles per hour. Let's say the roundabout's coming up. About 10 to 12 car lengths starts your mirrors, mm -hmm. then your signal. Now, we're just going to be going left for now. So mirrors and then signal left. And then your position towards the left. Now your position towards the left would be your normal driving position, mm -hmm. which is one meter. Yeah. If there are cars parked up, then you keep one meter from the cars. Yeah. Okay. Then you work on your speed. Now, what sort of speed do we like to do turns at? Um. This is around first and second lesson. Do we like to do turns at 20 miles per hour? Like 10 maybe? 10. Now, how do you go from 20 down to 10? Just go back into first gear. That's one option. Well, and then just like take your foot off the accelerator. That's another option. How do we warm the traffic that we're... Oh, brake. And brake. Then, yeah. okay, okay, that's it. So if you're driving at 20 miles per hour, you're just going to use your mirrors and start braking. Bring that number down. Okay. When it's down to 10, we then need to start to look. Now we need to make sure we've slowed down by about two to three car lengths before mm -hmm. the roundabout. Okay. So that now, all you're doing is you're looking you're assessing, you're deciding, and then you're acting on what you see. You're going to make a decision on the approach. Okay. It's either a go or a stop. If you're braking and you've decided, actually, yeah, I can go, just have a look around and look where you're going and mm -hmm. turn, like we just did on this last one. Okay. As you're approaching, when you're braking and you think, oh, actually, I'm not sure, or I can't see, or you see someone and you're like, mm -mm, I'm not going. Yeah. As you're braking, just throw that clutch in and keep braking. So the clutch needs to be down at yeah. least two car lengths okay. before the end. All right. Yeah. Yeah. Any questions about that? No, I think it makes sense. <laughs> so the routine will be mirrors, mm -hmm. then signal, position, slow down your speed, and then look. Okay. We've, we've already been doing this, but okay. it's just try and keep it, keep yourself on top of that routine so that you don't forget any part. Okay. But the main thing is always to make sure that you've given yourself time to make a decision. Okay. If you feel rushed at the end, just stop. Okay. Okay. All right, you ready to go? Yeah. Okay, I want you to show me how you would move off. Sorry. Okay. All right, so whenever you're ready, I'd like you to show me how you would move off on your own. done for checking your blind spot again because you waited for the car yeah. to pass. with a signal yeah just break a tiny bit clutch down into that corner keep going into that corner now mm -hmm. first gear quickly keep keep the steering turned next time okay here we go yeah yeah go on then go into that corner next time don't turn the wheel back because that's the okay. reason why you kind of went that way still keep it turned 
brilliant. Was that better? Yeah, that was really good. But well, because I turned a bit more towards the direction I was going. Yeah, you were kind of in that corner yeah. a bit more. Yeah, mirrors, good. And then, okay. So keep on the accelerator for now. This is a really open, wide junction, so we want to go in that corner. Really well done. You can actually start to speed up as well on this one. Okay. Because it's such a nice wide sort of entrance into here. Okay, we're going to change it up now a little bit. So we're going to do more of our left and right turns. Okay. So just a quick reminder, just keep an eye on that man in blue. Yeah. I think it's okay. Yeah. Speed up again to 20 okay. miles per hour. Brilliant. So with right turns, we have to turn in the second half of the road. And also make sure no one is in front before we turn. Okay. okay, so the first thing we're going to do at this roundabout is we're going to go straight. Okay, so do I not need to enter? We don't signal for straight, yeah. So keep okay. going forward all the way. Well done with the mirrors. Just keep going. Position a bit left and a bit of brake and look across. I think break, we can yeah. keep going. First okay. gear. Sorry. It's I'm okay. I'm just a bit nervous as well. Okay. After that van? Yeah. Yeah, accelerate. Oh, you've got the cyclist here now. Look the other way again. Is this side clear? Yeah, that's side clear. How do I? What if a car comes there? From the left, they'll wait for you. Okay. You have to give priority to your right. So is it clear? Crossing? Yeah. Yeah. Go forward. Slowly does it. We're going ahead, so just go in. Yeah. And then as they're approaching, they'll stop for you. Okay. Okay. Keep going. Move to the right a bit. You don't want to go near that edge. Okay. Good. Listen to the engine. So the roads we're going on to now, they are a little bit tighter, a few more parked cars, okay. but we're looking at our point of turn, maybe even stopping at jump some junctions, okay? So I want you to take the next road on your left, it is just after that white house, do the same okay. mirrors signal routine, so mirrors, and then, good, now where should your position be? To the left. Mm -hmm. What about your speed, what speed should it be? Ten. Break a little bit, that's it, wait for it. Bit turn a bit later. Turn the other way, turn the other way. Did you feel it? Yeah. What was that? That was the car. The back tyre. To the right a little bit. I don't know. Don't I'm move, do. don't move. Stay in, stay in the middle okay. for me. Okay. We're going to stop in the middle if need be, but I think it's going to work out. Okay. When you see the car, don't go, oh my god, there's a car. <laughs> okay? You've got to just stay in the middle. Do you want yeah. the sun visor down? Yeah. This is that better? Bit that stressed me out. This is dad. what you don't like, yeah. these roads. Now move into the middle. Let's pick up the pace a little bit. The thing with these type of roads is you have to identify an oncoming vehicle as early as possible. Okay. And then think about where the space is. Like now there's a big space here, mm -hmm. but then there's a next uh, another space on the right just here. And then after this one, there's another big space on the left. Can you see where the silver car is? Yeah. And then there's another one on the right. Can you see the van approaching? Yeah. He's turning, isn't he? Yeah. So keep going. But let's say he wasn't turning. He could easily fit on the right, can't he? Yes, just in there. Okay. That's it, and he fits in there. We continue through the middle. Now this junction is a giveaway junction, so keep so going up to the it. top. Now clutch down, please. Brilliant. Anything else? No. Are you change? sure? Um, first. Okay, we're going straight. Now look past the black car on the right. Can you see it? Yeah. Yeah. Anybody on the other side now? You're gonna have to use the accelerator. It's an uphill gradient, and just okay. keep looking everywhere and keep going. So even once you start moving, keep, you're not accelerating enough, it's not enough. You need to accelerate more for a okay. gradient, okay? Alright, speed up again, quickly. Yes. Good, a little bit quicker now. Okay. Alright, so this again, the road's not wide enough for two, it's not ideal. Yeah. But there's a few gaps on the right, can you see? Yeah. There's a little gap on the left also. You see the next gap is before the van. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we keep going for now. Okay, so let's say your car turns up at the very end. Yeah. We don't want to stop right here because yeah. then we're making no progress. We want to meet someone in the middle and there's a massive gap on the left and on the right for them. Mm -hmm. But let's say that was filled. Yeah. There's another gap on the left there where the junction is, can you see? Yeah. And then if you look on the right, there's another one behind the silver car. Okay. So you see there are spaces. But the first thing you want to do is just stay calm mm -hmm. and look for where the space is. 
think I've just had a bad experience of it now. So yeah, I know. It's just gonna so freak you out fun. a little bit. Yeah. <laughs> okay, stay straight for now. We're gonna do a right and then an immediate left from here. So okay. mirrors. Just, just, just focus on the stop first. Ooh. Stop just where you are. That car right there. Yeah. The, uh, was I too close? Yeah, yeah. that corner. Okay. Is that like a caravan? Yeah. Okay. You're just really close to the back corner of it, okay? We're going right, so the signal okay. should be on. Anything else you want to do? Okay. Brilliant. Now lean forward, start looking. You're going to have to use the accelerator, so slowly move forward. Okay. Yeah, start moving slowly. You get a press. Keep looking carefully. Look left, maybe. Yeah. Again, look right. Hold it. Yeah. Really nice. Well done. All right, so we're going left. One shift straightened up the wheel, then yeah. mirrors and signals. So mirrors. Top and left, signal, now in you go. So don't try and do too much at once. Okay. Good, listen to it. Ready. <laughs> All right, now I want you to lean forward. We're gonna be looking in the reflections on the right. Okay. If someone turns up, it's brake and clutch, okay? So keep going for now. Now there's a space on the right for him, or he's, is he parking, you see? Yeah, so. Now stay in the middle, but go slowly. Is he gonna be out of the way for you? So. Yeah, move right a little bit then. Yeah, stay right and just keep going. Okay. That's fine. Okay, and breathe in. Is that okay? Yeah. All right. Just got to be careful there here because the station. Near the station, yeah. Okay. Is it be all right to keep going? Yeah. Parking rest. Oh, they changed the layout. This they kind of made this a no entry for a little while, didn't they? I haven't. I didn't really come that down here. Yeah, they've changed it. It's great because it's a lot more open and yeah. Okay, yeah, they've really changed the layout around here. So. All right, we're going to do a left out of here. So let's okay. think about. Good and and yay! Burst. Okay, good. Should we take it? He's going the other way. Yeah. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Hold, hold the brake down because the other one's too close. Signal on again. Oh God! I need to stop straight. <laughs> Now look left, look right. This is a bit of a tricky one because it's uphill yeah. and then it dips downhill here. So you don't want to come off the clutch. You're going to use clutch control. So looking right, right's clear. Left, we can go before the green one. So go forward. Okay. <laughs> All right, don't worry. Yeah, it's... No one's behind you, don't worry. Okay, so we're going to go now. So slowly start moving. Yeah. Hold it, look both ways. Yeah. Keep it going out. Don't worry about the bus and then turn a lot more. There you go. Okay. And then turn the other way. There you go. Is that okay? Yeah. Anything else? You can do it. You can do it. Okay. Hold on. Good position on that road. Okay. I want you to take the next road on your right. On your right. Keep okay. going. Drive normally. Okay. It's where that white car, silver car has just come out. It's near the zebra crossing. Okay, just up there. Yeah, on your right. Okay, so look for the gap in the houses and the trees. Okay. With a lady, the person's yeah. with the dog, yeah. So mirrors, and then, now position should go next to the center line, okay. but not over. Now we're not worried about that black car in the road, okay? So go next to the center. We're gonna turn after this lady. So just start steering, lots of it. Is that okay? Yeah. So why were we not concerned about this guy? Um, Exactly, you are on the main road, you have priority. Okay. Good, stay right because this vehicle's sticking yeah. out. Okay, now turn right in here, try this one on your own. Very nice, and I'm glad you used the brake on that one. That's good. You gonna be okay with the van, do you think? Is either yeah. they're going to move in or you're going to move to the left. Okay. So how do you like judge like who waits for who? Do you know what I mean? We'll like, talk about that in just a second. Okay. Just deal with this corner. Just tuck into that corner slowly. Don't turn too much because your back tire will hit otherwise. Okay. Now if you can just pull in here behind okay. that car. So think about what you need to do for parking. Braking clutch. 
and just keep rolling ever so slowly. Give yourself a bit of space in front to be able to move away as well. Is that okay? Yeah. As long as you feel you can move away easily from here. Do you want me to? Yes. The kill and switch off the engine. Oh my god, I always get that wrong. <laughs> Alrighty. Okay. Now breathe. How's it going? That yeah, last bit? Okay. Yeah. The junction turns have been alright? Yeah, it didn't feel too bad off the main road timing. Mm -hmm. We're gonna I go know. back to them yeah. again. I didn't. I felt guided by that other car that turned in, so <laughs> I was just like, okay. It was nice because it kind of just worked yeah. really well because no one was in front. Yeah. But if somebody had been in front, we kind of just sit. We just wait. We block and, this yeah. guy. That doesn't matter. Yeah. Okay. Good. Um, your question about meeting. How do you decide who gives way and where? Yeah. It just depends on where the space is. So what I would always do with meeting situations is. You're here and they're at the end. You try and meet somewhere in the middle. Yeah. Now in the middle, look at where the biggest gap is. Is the big gap on the left or on the right? And then also judge their speed. If they're fast, then they're going to get to you quicker. And you know, if you're faster, then you're going to get closer to them. So whoever's really going fast is kind no, of... No, no, it's not to do with their speed. Uh, you have to, the speed would decide where you're going to meet along the road. Okay. Whether you're going to meet closer to you, closer to them, or in the middle. It's to do with where the space is. So obviously, you'd always try and give way in the biggest space. So if the biggest space is on the right and there's a space on the left, mm -hmm. then obviously they'll go into the right, you can go through the middle. And then just ju judge what the car in front's doing. Okay. That's kind of how it's decided. But if you if you notice that there, there is a space on the right, but they're kind of not moving over, but then you've also got space on the left, then you have to just slow down and get into that space if they don't look like they're moving over. Okay. But the best thing to do with meeting situations is always look for the space, try and give way. Don't try and push through. Because if you're trying to give way and they're also trying to give way, you know, it's easier than yeah. both of you trying to push through, not giving yeah. way. Okay. Okay? Okay. Overall, I felt like you were doing good with the junctions. Uh, we do need to be a little bit quicker once you've stopped to firstly change gear okay. and then look and start moving. Because you sometimes get there and you kind of think, oh, I can't see. Yeah. And then you have another few looks and then you're like, oh, yeah, move forward. As soon as you've stopped, look and listen if it's clear move out a bit more because mm -hmm. then there's no point of you sitting in that same position and looking back and forth so okay yeah once you're on the main road it's quite easy to keep driving yeah it's coming from a side road onto a main road or going from a main road into a side road these are the tricky bits and that's what we've been working on today okay okay yeah we're gonna go do some more practice on this now okay but yeah that's the end of our driving lesson today hopefully that information will be useful as you can see it's very easy to get stressed out by other drivers, but that's something you want to learn to deal with quite early on, actually. Because you don't want to let them sort of make the decision on what you're doing at this junction and affect the way you come out. Because then you're going to make a mistake because of somebody else stressing you out. And it's, I know it's not nice, but it's something you've got to just go, okay, well, whatever. Let me focus on what I'm doing. Mm -hmm. okay. okay. All right. Thank you for watching. Mm -hmm.